Hi everybody, I'm Lynn with Plasma Energy Solution and thanks for being with us today. I said I was going to do a giveaway for all of you that participated in Dr. Paul's gift and I want to thank you. So many of you did and I really, really appreciate that. So the gift was that we were going to do a drawing and somebody could select from a shungite, an amazonite shungite pendant, which you see on the left, an amazonite lapis pendant, which you see in the middle, or an amazonite fluorite pendant that you see on my right. And so we're going to do a very high tech. Oh, I didn't realize they were covered up. Of course they are. They're they're magnets. So let me let me see if I can do that one more time. And they don't cover each other up. Yep, there they went again. <laughs> okay. Well, now you know the magnets work, right? So oh, and one thing I'll mention: these are done with a silk cord, and sometimes that cord will, even if it's in a square knot, it'll slip a little. So I always take a little fabric glue and just glue the knot and then you know you have a knot that's not going to slip. So that's just a little hint I have for you for not having your uh, silk cord come apart on your pendants, on your shungite pendants. So I have a very high-tech way to do this. I have all the orders for January in my notebook here. And I have them all numbered. And I have all the numbers here in this basket. And I, I cut them all up and I'll mix them all up here. And I'll do it so I can't even see what I'm drawing. Okay, and a little more mixing. Okay, and I'm just going to draw a number here. Okay, and I have drawn number 22. So I'm going to go into my very high-tech arrangement here and find out who number 22 is. And let me pull that out of my records. And, of course, I've stuffed in more than I can pull out easily. Okay, so this is for Annette. Uh, Annette is overseas. And it's Annette Booman, so if she will contact me, and I'm also going to email her and let her know that she has won her choice of an Amazonite fluorite or lapis pendant. So thank you again, everybody, for participating and, and especially for all the orders that you placed. I, I really, really do appreciate that. So thank you. Um, so now we'll get on to some, what, what we're doing this month, and sorry, I just, I've kind of got a lot of things here on my table, and I want to, first of all, I'll tell you about the February special, and it's our winter support package, and we're trying to pay attention to the season for viruses, different flu viruses, and of course there's been some in the news lately, a whole lot in the news lately. So our special includes lungs, healthy lung, detox, pain relief, and peace. And you can add your choice of cold relief, inflammation relief, memory, clean mouth, eczema relief, or even pet skin itch relief. So this gives you a $328 value for $257. And I thank you for those of you who have already started taking advantage of that special. I do try to do something every month that um, maybe helps you fill, fill some, add some vials to your plasma pantry. And so that's our February special. And what about the viruses? There's just, there's a lot of maybe conflicting or confusing information. And so I'm just going to cover something today that I just happened to check my email before I started. And here it is, breaking news. 
the city of Shenzhen is now to be quarantined. And that's quite a large city. Um, there will be a total lockdown with no vehicles allowed to travel anywhere. So there may, what would you do in a situation like that? Would you, would you want to hunker down? Would you want to leave right away to get with others in your, in your family, your acquaintance, or just away from what might be a bad situation? That's a very tough call and it's going to be a very individual call for different families and different people. So what may happen here though is in the rush to leave, are we having people who are already incubating that virus? So that's one reason for saying let's have a, a winter special that addresses all these types of things. And again, I'll review what that is. Uh, lung support, or I call it healthy lung, detox, pain relief, peace, and then your choice of cold relief, inflammation relief, memory or clean mouth, eczema or pet skin. And all, any of those you can choose. It does not matter to me. And all you have to do when you make your order in the comments, don't order the one that's your choice. Um, just in the comments say, I would like you to send cold relief or inflammation relief or whatever. Okay? So that will cover that. And so the other, there's some other breaking news. Um, there are a couple of cruise ships now that have been quarantined. So what are you going to do if you're in a situation, and let's say you have a, your plasma energy and you've got a good start on a plasma energy pantry. Well, now how can you share these with other people? We've talked about that before and we've talked about you're giving a vial from your water to someone else. You can you can make a vial and even put it in a little spray bottle to give to someone. You can see the vial in the bottom of this. And I just happened to pick up Clear Mind. And we always say you can use translucent with color, but you have to be able to see inside of the container. So translucent glass, translucent plastic for your spray bottles, for your, um, your bottles that, that you're making your energy waters. Now this is a glass I carry of drinking water, but as you can see, this is n this is very opaque. This is not going to work as far as uh, transferring the plasma energies from the outside of the container. Let's say I put on a um, a set of patches, and a lot of you have written to me about well, what about having it on my favorite piece of crock? crockery or a stainless steel container and guys I'm sorry that just isn't going to work and so what you're going to do if you end up you can do the vials or if you end up uh, doing patches those are going to attach to the outside of your container and remember these patches can be any size they can be half the size okay they can even be less than half the size. This doesn't fold so well. I've got so many layers of tape on, on it. But they can even be this size on your container. So size is not the issue with plasma energy. We're trained in the kitchen where a teaspoon is smaller than a cup and that's smaller than a gallon. But that is not so with the plasma energy. Okay? So how do I do these patches? Well, when I start out, and here's a batch that I've just done, and this is called Anxiety. Now be sure if you're doing a batch of them, I find uh, pants, hangers work very well to let, um, hang them up and let them all dry. They're going to be soaked first, and then you're going to hang them up to dry. Always label what you've done. How do I know that? Because if I forgot to label and left it for a couple days, I'm going... Which one is this? So be sure, be sure, be sure to label. Okay, so when I get them out here then, I'm going to take them off the hangers and I'm going to fold them. 
You can either just store them like a dinner napkin in a plastic baggie. This is, happens to be thyroid support, okay? So you can store them in a plastic baggie until you get around to making them into sets of patches. Now, I've shown you this before, but I want to show you again. Here are two pieces of paper towel, and this is the size I started out with, okay? So now I've got two pieces, and what I'm going to do with these two pieces is I want three parts to one part. And these aren't always going to fold super well, even though you try and make your fold be perfect. Sometimes I live in an imperfect world. So, all right. So here's what I'm going to do. I've got it folded, and I'm going to cut this one. So now this makes up one side of my pair of patches. This one goes in this side. So now I have one, and it's going to hang out a little, so just get it inside, and then you can make the edges kind of line up. And then I'm going to take and put this in a plastic bag, and of course I have a plastic bag here somewhere. And what you want to do with your plastic bags is, well, I've got so much stuff here I can't find it, but let me show you, because I'll just use this one. First of all, I would cut this off, the ribbing, and then that gives me just the plastic bag without the ribbing to work with. And then I'm going to put these in the baggie, and I'm going to put them in either side, and yeah, you know what, I'm just going to keep on showing you guys how I do this. It's got more plastic bags, so we'll just make one with another labor, layer. Okay, now I've got them in the plastic bag. I'm going to fold, do a fold over, and just kind of shove them on the sides of the bag there. And then do a fold over, and a little scotch tape will hold your fold over while you're getting organized with everything else. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of my labels and I, I just have a blank so I can put I can write in whatever it's for so I happen to have two written up for thyroid and I'll put those labels on here so we've got the number two side and, and just because I'm in the habit of doing it that way you don't have to do it that way it's going to work fine however you label it um, there's the number two side and there's the number one side and it's very obvious because this side is thicker than this side. Okay, then once I have those done, and this will make the cats run for cover, There's it must sound like nails on a chalkboard to a cat's ears. All right, you're just gonna tape over your label and your fold and then what you're going to do, since I'm since I'm doing these up, I have my little plasma energy labels I like to put on them, okay? And I usually put those on before I put that tape on, but it's not an issue because there's going to be lots more tape. And then I just try to shake it down into the sides, into the edges. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take and I'm going to cut this. And now you've got two separate little plastic packages. And just because it's convenient to do it this way, tape it down. And then go ahead and tape the other guy down. And remember, you've already labeled these. You aren't, you're not going to rely on memory. And then go back and say, oh yeah, I'll remember what this is because you might not if you don't get right back to it. So then I just take this tape and start working it. I start on the back side and I tape over that raw edge. And then I'm going to take and put two layers of tape around the front side to hook over the edges. And then I'm going to take a layer and wrap it around one, two, 
and three. And now you've got all these little edges on the back, so I'm going to take one more layer and wrap it around there. Now what happens with these if they get worn for whatever reason? Just simply get another plastic bag and put the whole works in a new plastic bag and tape it shut. Don't ever take it out of the bag because your, your plasma energy towel or cloth that you've used will be intact and you don't need to take it out and put the whole works in a new bag. Just put this inside of a new bag. So that's the way I do those to get them ready to send out to someone else. You can always use BPA-free um, containers like you would use for traveling. And there's some that are small for makeup or, or lotions or things like that. And then we have the little larger size that we use. Now, if you're going to be traveling, maybe we're not going to have any issues here in, in our country. You know, we certainly hope not, but we have a, a real... Um, globe-trotting society, I'll call it, right now, where people are traveling from, from many countries to many other countries. So, again, what I've suggested, if you're going to wear some kind of a mask, why not take some of your plasma energy and spray on the mask and let it dry? And that can be what you take with you. You could also spray it on a bandana and let that dry. And the other thing you could do is you could take a pair of gloves and I've got a pair here. And these are just um, the what they call examination gloves, okay? And these have been soaked in a bowl of plasma energy water. I think I used uh, pain relief on these. Now because I do a lot of typing, if I wear these, my fingertips are open. But if you're wearing them as protection, then you're going to want to leave the fingertips on them. Okay? What I found to be really useful is I have a pair of these at my desk for wearing when I'm, when I'm working. And especially, you know, like when I'm making all the baggies and all the pads, after you do a repetitive motion for a while, you're maybe your hands, let's rephrase that, sometimes my hands get a little fatigued, okay? So then I just put these on and, and keep working with it. And if I didn't use these, but I realize at bedtime that maybe my hand or arm is a little sore, I'll just stick these under my pillow, and then I've got them handy if I wake up during the night and, and my hand or my arm is sore. So that's just, that's just some hints for you. Um, I mean, you can spray your winter hats, your winter scarves, your winter gloves. You can put the water in your clothing in the rinse water when you're laundering them and just let them sit there for a little while. So there's a lot of ways to use it. And, and the biggest way, don't forget, is drink the water. You, I, once the water's made, I carry it in this and uh, I have it with me. But I use it in coffee, I use it in tea, I use it in soup, I use it in recipes, I use it in the cat's drinking water, and I use it on my plants. So be really liberal with, the, with your plasma energy waters that you have because they're useful, they help bring balance to the body, and they help bring balance to your environment. So I want to thank you for watching this. I want to thank you for those of you who did make a purchase in um, January. I got a little cat here who wants to remind me that it's three hours until feeding time. And she starts doing this, especially if we're on camera. <laughs> so anyway, um, thank you again for participating. And Annette, I will send you an email that you were the winner of my very sophisticated way of drawing. And please do go look at our website, plasmaenergysolution.com. The blogs are being organized, the blogs are all available to read on the right side of the homepage. You can go to 
frequently asked questions and testimonials, they're being organized as best they can on um, on, on that section of the website. Sometimes I cover a lot of different topics in the frequently asked questions and testimonials. So they may be under organized under just one of those topics. Um, we have lots of videos that we have done for you. So if you go to products, just pick products at the top of the home page. And if you'll look there, we've got a lot of our videos that we've done. You can also find our videos at Plasma Energy Solution YouTube channel. Uh, and I believe I have another one called Lynn Schmaltz channel. I've been trying to concentrate on one channel. And so most of them now are going up on the Plasma Energy Solution channel. So if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Please share it with others if you wish. And thank you so much for joining. And as I said, please go to PlasmaEnergySolution.com and we'll see you next time I do a video. Thank you.